Hey everybody and welcome back to our channel where we make tech easy. In today's video, we are diving into one of the most user-friendly tools out there, which is SATA PDF Editor. So if you have ever needed to edit, sign, or merge PDFs, but you didn't want to deal with complex software or confusing interfaces, then SATA might be exactly what you are looking for. So let's begin. Now, if you go to the official website of SATA, there's going to be three options on the top right corner. You have the pricing if you wanted to know more about it, if you wanted to scale up. The personal comes at week pass for $5, absolutely a one-time payment for seven days. The web monthly is around $7.50. Desktop plus web annual is $63 dollars per year for teams and volume discounts you might want to make sure that you provide all the information needed and you're going to be having all of the team pricing but the good thing about it is that they offer a login section where you can if you don't have an account yet click this create an account but if you don't want to deal any of it don't worry because we can edit a pdf document for free just going to the main home page you just have to choose one of the 30 plus PDF tools right here. You can split, compress, delete pages, merge, PDF to Word, fill and sign, extract pages, merge, and a lot more. So we're going to go to the PDF editor. So all I have to do is click this button right here. And you need to upload a PDF file. If you do, there's going to be a drop down menu here where you can choose from Google Drive, Dropbox, OneDrive, web address, and recent files. Now I have uploaded a sample PDF file and then from here these are going to be the tools that you can use. All right, there's going to be a text you can find and replace right here you can add text. So let's say let's let's try to add a text here. All right, all I have to do is type it in for example. And you can be creative, you can make it bold, have a different font size, maybe like this it's too much let's say let's decrease that around here maybe just it's around here for font color you can of font style you can use any of these font color is going to be something like that you can be creative you're not limited and of course you also have the option to create a link now for the link link to external url what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go very quickly to our youtube channel if you haven't already you might want to click the subscribe button so you'll get notifications to our latest content it helps all right it helps us so please hit the like and subscribe now copying the url here i'm gonna link that and of course once you've done that we're good so we can drag this text right here of course you have the opportunity to do that and then there's going to be, you can add images if you want or delete existing images. And of course, on the form, you can add text, multi-line, drop-down list, ready button, and checkbox, signature box, and all these. If you want to add images, you can try to create a new image. Just like this one. So I have added a new image right here. And then you can also add a signature. If you do, for example, we're going to type in... So we're going to use this signature and I'm going to put it here, all right? If you want to white out, you can do that, annotate. For example, I'm going to create a strike out. So around here, underline here, it also add shapes. For example, rectangle, all right? It also add, say, for example, a line. From, and then you can add, once you've done that, click the apply changes. Your task is processing. Now you have the option to download the PDF absolutely at no cost. Not only that, you also have an option to share the link. If you want to send this to your client, maybe to if you're working in a collaborative environment, your team members or other freelancers, you can put the recipient's email address and add a note here. All right, for example, um, Recipient's email is going to be this. Send by email. All right.
you can also share the link to your social media support channels all right create a link copy that link send it to whatsapp instagram snapchat and a lot more the good thing about it is that you also have an option to continue with a workflow merge edit compress and delete pages crop or more tools so you have all of that option i'm not gonna save this right now because what i'm going to do is i'm gonna go back to the main home page for example if you don't have any pdf right here right so i'm gonna go back there is an option to start with a blank document all right start a blank document and of course you can put multiple options here as we you go along the way so that's another option or there's another option if you wanted to install the desktop version of SATA. it's free download available for mac intel mac silicon windows windows 64 bit and linux all i'm going to do is click on the free download and follow the on-screen instructions and then you should be able to download or install the SATA for pdf desktop editor all right but the thing is it's free and limited but if you wanted to work offline this is going to be your go-to pdf for a desktop similar to the online you have all of the tools you can compress edit extract pages merge and crop alternate and mix merge organize and a lot more if you want to compress a file you can do that choose just pdf right here you have an option to a medium compression good or best and compress pdf all right and then select the folder that you wanted and then if you go here these are gonna be some of the options if you want to fill and sign right here that's gonna be another option click the apply changes select the folder folder that you want to save this if you want to split the document you can do that right here or merge there's a lot of options that you can do all right there's going to be a help window file and edit here on the top corner and with that being said and that's a wrap on today's tutorial on how to use a SATA pdf editor i hope you now feel more confident in navigating its features to edit your pdfs seamlessly of course as you can see earlier SATA offers a user-friendly experience before editing merging and splitting pdfs with both free and premium options depending on your needs all right before you go let me give you my final verdict because if you're looking for a tool that's quick and efficient with no complicated setup as you can see it's both available online no need to create an account or also on the desktop SATA is definitely worth checking out remember to hit that like button if you found this video helpful and do not forget to subscribe for more software tutorials just like this one and again guys if you have any questions or tips on using SATA, drop them in the comments below and we will be happy to chat with you thank you so much for watching and we will see you in the next one